guys what is up um so typically i come here to tell you some ways that you can you know reduce stress by being present in the moment tapping into the present moment because that's where all the magic is right and today i actually want to come back here to present to you something a little bit atypical because it has nothing to do with being in the present moment in fact it has everything to do with being in the future so um there's actually studies that support this. So let me explain what this means to you. So one is that studies have found that when someone is just merely uh, you know, anticipating watching a funny movie, like that, like they're anticipating laughing because they know that this movie's supposed to be funny, that alone reduced the cortisol level in their body. So this was actually tested by a saliva test, which is so powerful, meaning that you don't even have to watch the funny movie. Of course, that's gonna reduce the cortisol level. And to number two. Number two is anticipation of any ritual that is related to some kind of relaxation activity. So uh, that will also decrease the cortisol level in your body, reducing stress. So meaning, for example, for me, I love running. I love doing yoga to relax. So for me, just getting ready for yoga alone, me putting on my yoga pants, or me just getting ready for a run, that alone will start to decrease the cortisol level in my body. For you, maybe you go um, and take a bath. I don't know, like whatever that ritual is, that's going to, the anticipation of that particular ritual associated with relaxation can start to reduce cortisol level in your body so this is the secret you guys that nothing even has to change in the external world for us to reduce stress or tap into a different state in our body really it's our thoughts alone our thoughts about something amazing happening in the future our thoughts about doing something that's relaxing in the future that alone starts to change the chemicals in our brain and in our body so I invite you guys to think about this you know, this is really the power of visualization that we can really utilize and leverage for our benefit if we like. So nothing even has to happen, you guys. Just think about amazing things happening. And the truth is, that's one of the best ways that you're going to start to manifest even amazing-er things, more amazing things happening.